Yo, how's everyone? Um, yeah, it's been a while since I've uh, done a YouTube episode. So um, yeah, as always, my excuse is I've been busy with work, but that's the honest truth. Before we get to the video, yeah, I've, I've just had um, issues with recording these episodes. As you can see, it's not smooth. It's, it's, there's a bit of lag. In the video so if anyone out there can give me some advice or any tips or um, any recommendations that'll be awesome because um, yeah I'm using an app on my phone uh, as my webcam it's really annoying and I'm trying to find a solution I don't know if it's maybe my network but um, uh, in my apartment block just the other day uh, the management said that they're replacing new fiber optics or something so the internet should be faster so fingers crossed uh for those of you who are new to this channel let me just quickly uh let you guys know what this channel is about i am a commercial film director and basically i showcase really cool commercials yeah you might think commercials but yeah there are really amazing cinematic commercials out there uh, created by really amazing uh, filmmakers and you know not everyone including myself can make it to Hollywood uh, so this is a good substitute for us to you know be able to um, tell our creative visions uh, through commercials and we get to play with all the awesome toys that the fine folks of Hollywood use so yeah I haven't been able to record as many episodes as I would like because uh, two weeks ago I caught COVID I believe it was Omicron because I did not uh, yeah because I was able to still taste and yeah that's um, yeah it took me a good week to fully recover I occasionally cough from time to time but yeah I am 100% clear feeling great i do feel tired and i don't know if it's if it's from the after um effects no pun intended uh or if it's just the weather here because it's starting to get hot and so i'm starting to i don't know I, I, I'm, I'm getting very tired quite easily and um yeah it's taken me several attempts to record a new video i've been itching to to record something cool for you guys it's just uh yeah just things in the way work um things have been pushed back delayed i've had a ton of work that's just been pushed a lot of planning and something that was meant to be shot in march has been pushed to not even april has been pushed to may and something now that was originally meant to be shot in may has now been pushed to june so what can you do? That's uh, that's the nature of uh, the industry. That's all good. Um, at least I got this channel to um, to go back to and um, connect with you today. Um, this is actually a video I have recorded in the past, but I wasn't so happy with the with the results. So I'm doing this again, and it's a video that I discovered a couple of years ago go i won't be showcasing or, or discussing the particular director who was involved but more the cinematographer because um <clears throat> i discovered this spot from friends in thailand uh so, so by the way it is a this is shot by a thai cinematographer i was on my bed and i just woke up i checked my phone and i was just scrolling through facebook or instagram one of those and um yeah a lot of my thai friends have had had posted this up and i was saying yeah this is done by um one of our um, senior cinematographers so yeah checked it out blown away and can't wait to share it with you sorry but i just don't know how to pronounce his name as always for those of you who are familiar with my, with this channel i'm 
hopeless with names. Something I've got to work on. But uh, but in this case, I mean, Thai people tend to have very long names, and for the life of me, I cannot pronounce it. It's like what what did what did try what did try, and then his family names like goes on forever. But I believe he shortened his name to what? I think that's how you pronounce it. What? Or I'll just use that. What? What? Sound effect. Um, <clears throat> I'll put his link to his website and Vimeo in the description. So check out more of his work. But uh, yeah, you can check out more of what work. But yeah, shot by what? And the director. Okay, I could at least credit him because he. he um, I was I was able to briefly look at his work and it's amazing. So I'll also leave a link to his work. His name's Christoph and his last his family name, Trudy Mark. Before we get to this, uh, I just want to say that um, yeah, I would love to see a making of this. Like I can imagine just the whole idea and the whole pre-production process and just how every everything just worked out seamlessly for this project it's um amazingly executed and it's it's hard for me to explain i think it's something you have to watch and experience for yourself let's discuss further after diving in and watching this awesome commercial for the product is the product is a good mood uh, I believe it's uh, some sort of beverage or like a like a, a flavored water. Uh, I hope I haven't been lagging, but having a look at me now, I have. But at least my voice is not lagging, so that's cool, right? I'll be fixing this up eventually, guys. So uh, just bear with me. Let's get ready. So here we. Anamorphic lens, I can see some nice lens flares. I knew it wasn't a good choice. A lot of um, long takes, huh? A few long takes, I see. You know, you watch something like this and you wonder how many takes it took for them to get the right shot and everyone getting their um, spots correct. Oh, look at that, that's insane. You know, something like this to organize and choreograph everything you see here, it's not easy. Um, yeah, see that's the Bluebird Taxi. So I assume this is somewhere in Jakarta? <clears throat> but yeah, there's a lot of um, many moving parts. Um, yeah, I'm just I'm just curious how the whole planning process was like um, putting something like this together. Um, I assume they blocked a section of the road, but it looks like a pretty busy area. I don't know. Are they, are they dressed it up to look like? 
But this blue bird taxi looks a bit because usually the color's a bit lighter, so I oh know. Um, hmm. Malaysia? I don't know. See that lens flare? What lens was used? What? Would like to know. Um. Yes. Everything most likely was a steady cam operator or Ronin. The flutter. transition. Change your mood, change your world. So, that was a long one. That went for four minutes and 30 seconds. So what do you guys think? I, I absolutely loved it when it came out. And remember, this was like four or five years ago. Go, go check out Christoph's work and also go check out work really amazing stuff yeah I, I would love to know the whole post no uh, the pre-production process how long that took yeah and how much of it was already kind of thought out before the director was um was uh, hired or before the director was chosen and how many days it was to put this whole thing together really interested in to know so hopefully who knows um this video will reach out to what and or could reach out to christoph and maybe we can get some more detailed juicy information so the future of this channel um i, I really want to put more into this channel in terms of the production and everything i think first thing first things first i would need to work on the whole lag issue it's distracting even for me when I'm looking at myself here on the video, it's just, yeah, that's not quite there. Um, <clears throat> and yeah, uh, I can really do with your support. So yeah, if you like today's episode, please give a thumbs up and you can really help this channel out by sharing, letting your friends and, or family know, uh, or even people who you think might be interested in uh, just the whole filmmaking process. For those um, who want to be film directors or inspired to be filmmakers, uh, this is the channel for you because I'll be um, I'll be sharing with you my experiences as well as my inspirations and yeah and just everything the whole filmmaking process. Last month, oh yeah, the funny thing was yeah, so I did shoot something. Um, and then I caught COVID straight after the shoot. It was a two day shoot. Um, yeah, things went semi smooth. There is a passion project that I've been um, wanting to make. It's just been delayed, uh, but it will happen sooner or later. Uh, yeah, so before I end this episode, please uh, check out please go visit my Instagram, Aswa underscore hand, my Facebook, uh, Patreon, and yeah, just simply like this episode, 
share and leave a comment please leave a comment let me know if you have any questions about the about the commercial or film industry and i'll be more than happy to answer your questions until then hopefully i'll see you in the next awesome episode you see that delay <laughs>